How um, if you see someone famous, how do you like react? Do you do do you do like a wave, or do you just sort of notice them and move on? Do you do you walk up and say hi? I love your work, or like what's this? What what's the idea? It depends, because I once saw uh, Mark Heap of um was it Fast Train? Was that what he did? Uh, I don't know who he is. If you Google him, you'll probably sure. recognize him. He did, um, yeah, he's in like a lot of British comedy things. I saw him on the tube, but his name escaped me and I was too scared oh, to go yeah, up to him yeah. because I couldn't remember his name. Okay, I see. But I, I was like a really big fan, but his name had just <laughs> out my head. So I was oh, just like, so I can't like, go over yeah, and be you. like, Who are you, you <laughs> famous man. So I was just like, oh, so I just sort of watched him go by. Like, I oh, recognize him mostly there from he space. Is. I think. Spaced, of course. I forgot he was in there. He yeah. was Brian, wasn't he? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, Brian. Um, but I guess I sort of got used to working with famous people in my old job. So I was yeah. just sort of like... You were around like used to movie them. stars all the time. Just like... Yeah. Yeah. It's a lot of people ones. that I would like recognize, but I wasn't that particularly like hugely fussed about. But then occasionally you'd meet someone who was like a big deal to you mm. and you then i sometimes would just get a bit like oh my god <laughs> but you have to try and so keep in cool. that case <laughs> did you go up and talk to them or did you just not do anything i did i talked to okay. mark williams was probably he's sort of most known and from the fast show and being ron weasley's dad in the films um okay. mr weasley i worked with Ramesh Ranganathan. Yeah. Back when he wasn't really known in a big way. Because obviously now he's got like TV shows and podcasts mm. and all of this stuff. Um, but I remember when I first saw him on TV, like years later, I was like, I know, oh, that, that, guy. I know that guy. Yeah. <laughs> he filmed yeah. an episode of Holby City where he had to cancel a date because he fell off a ladder and got a screwdriver penetrated into his chest. <laughs> <laughs> oh damn! And that's that's where I knew him from. I was like, he had a screwdriver in his chest when I met him. <laughs> he's like, "Hi, you're the screwdriver guy." He's like, "What?" <laughs> now he's a TV funny man. I think I, I've um, I've met Greg Davis and I worked with him, but it's mm. before I watched Taskmaster. And I think if uh, I met him now, it would be different. I'd probably. Yeah, whereas before I sort of knew who he was through the mm. comedy circuits, but yeah. I was just like, oh, what a large man. <laughs> what a lot of man I'm looking at right That's now. Many, many, He's very many, tall. many men, you know, yeah. Mm. yeah. One and a half men's high. One and a half, yeah, <laughs> basically. Like you'd seen him on like in between or so or whatever. And then like, oh, hello, you know, and then. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I guess that's where I'd know him from. I was just like, mm. oh, it's the teacher guy. Mm. Um, that's where I saw him. But then there's second. like other people who I worked with who other people were more excited that I'd worked with them than I was. Because oh, I was just yeah. like, I don't really like Anthony Head. I think people who watch Buffy were oh, like, oh, yeah. my God, you remember that? And whereas you I was like, I don't know who this oh, is. Oh, my God, you work with Giles. <laughs> yeah, yeah. It was very nice, but I just I didn't yeah. I didn't know who he was. You I've never really seen know Buffy. Who he was or whatever, so yeah. Don't, the weirdest yeah. one I had was I became quite a big fan of Ashleen B, who's like mm. a Irish comedian. Yeah, she was and, also um, a taskmaster. Yeah. I was like looking. I watched a TV show with her in, and then I was mm. like, oh, I wonder what else she's done. And I was scrolling down her IMDb, and I'd worked with her before. <laughs> and I was like, did I? <laughs> <laughs> I was like, I recognize that. I did that. And then if you actually look at the IMDb photos, there's a photo with me in. I was like, there I am. <laughs> so I've met her. I just didn't know who she was at the time. But in retrospect, it's quite cool. There's a picture of me on her IMDb wearing a T-shirt that is two unicorns doing it under a rainbow. <laughs> Lovely. Yeah, Lovely. <laughs> 